Phone's on. It may not be as loud as the one you got over there, but it's on. Might have to choke going a little bit here. <laughs> that makes it easier. Well, guys, we're under a, a, a pretty heavy threat called the red flag laws. The red flag laws is, is spread across the nation in different states. We've got Maryland that's ushered red flag laws in. We got Florida to touch your red flag laws in, guys. <laughs> we don't want red flag laws here in the state of Arkansas. Now, the governor presides in this building behind me here, Mr. Asa Hutchinson. He has been entertaining the concept of red flag laws. We do not want them here in the state of Arkansas. We do know the red flag laws will be like a lot of other reporting or mandated reporting. It will be weaponized. We've already seen it weaponized. Just like some of the reporting with the Department of Human Services has been weaponized amongst people. Anytime law enforcement, somebody can call law enforcement up and they can come to your house, knock on your door, and say that we've had complaints, that you're unstable, so forth, or you may be a threat to yourself or other people, and they can take firearms out of your home and make you appear in a court of law to justify yourself as being sane and stable enough to own a firearm. It's totally against the Second Amendment of the United States. It's totally against the Second Amendment of the state of Arkansas. Guys, we've got to come out. We've got to get active, and we've got to quit this. We, we, we've got to stop this in its tracks. <clears throat> Here recently, the state of Arkansas has become a right-to-carry state. We're making a lot of grounds on the Second Amendment. The state of Arkansas has been becoming freer and freer to gun owners in the last 10 years since uh, the passing of Act 746 and the clarification of Act 746. Guys, we can't sit down. Now, the liberals know that they're not getting anywhere on the federal level. They're not going to get anywhere in D.C. They're not going to get anywhere with Donald Trump when it comes to gun control. They know that. So that's the reason they're pouring money in state by state, attacking the states, because the states are separate entities under the Tenth Amendment. So that's the reason the primary fight is not in D.C. It's in each and every one of your state. A lot of people don't understand that uh, because all the emphasis is always on D.C. But under the 10th Amendment, each state can pass its own laws. They can be more restrictive than federal law, just not less restrictive. So like I said, guys, that's the reason we co I come up here today to speak about this because I think we really need to bring awareness to it. There's a lot of bad things going on in the state of Maryland under the red flag laws I've been hearing lately. I got killed. We've been having 30-round uh, magazine bans can be a class 4 felony now in some places. Guys, we don't want this here in the state of Arkansas. I'm sure K-Rag Johnson over there don't want that in the state of Mississippi either. And that's the reason we come together today here in the great capital state of Arkansas to let the governor, Asa Hutchinson, know that we do not want red flag in the state of Arkansas. Here you go, Bill Brock. All right, thank you, Billy. Everybody, give Billy a good hand of applause. Woo! Hands go. Warm them up.